Hello everybody, my name is Banala Manaisa and welcome to my YouTube channel. I hope you guys are well. Welcome to a vlog. I have not vlogged in a hot minute. So this is going to take some adjusting and some getting used to. I am in my fuck it era <laughs> when it comes to filming in public. I'm just like, yeah. I am a YouTuber, I am a content creator, so I'm going to have my camera out. I'm going to have a tripod following me. This is happening. I'm trying to get things done. So <clears throat> I decided to vlog this weekend. I was thinking about it. I was like, okay, so I've got two sit down videos. What else am I going to do? And my weekend is actually so jam packed. Um, I won't vlog every single thing, but I'll vlog some things. So today is Friday. Um, excuse me i did nothing exciting this is literally the first time i'm getting out the house i was on a fun instagram live just a couple of seconds ago so those who are on that live know that i was on my way to the gynecologist i am on my way to the gynecologist right now i need to go get things checked out um i put on an iud when we went to the midlands the, that week so it was like the last week of may so a couple of months ago maybe two months ago yeah two months ago almost two months exactly actually i put in a, a, a kailina iud i had a kayuna kayuna i had a kailina iud before i had kumo and then i fell out and then i fell pregnant and uh, yeah i know i went back to it because i really don't want to have any more babies right now so I put a Kailina because my gynae does not trust me to take the pills. And yeah, so here we are putting it in a Kailina. And lo and behold, I started feeling it the other day and it is trying to eject itself from. There's no way. How the hell do you think? No. Uh, no. Excuse me. This guy. Anyway, I felt it the other day on Saturday, like six days ago, and this thing is trying to make its way out of me, and I am freaking out. I asked him also if he could feel it, and he said no, and so I don't know. Really weird. So I'm going to check if it's still in place and still intact, because I'm not playing those games. Um, it's kind of feeling like my body rejects an IUD, which is so weird because the Mirena stayed in me for a year and a half. Granted, a Kylina is a little bit smaller, so maybe my cervix is just like, what is going on? I don't know. We'll see what Dr. Zender says today. But yeah, just in case there are any little thoughts wanting to know, no, I'm not pregnant. Definitely not pregnant. Um, just want to make sure that I stay not pregnant. Um, yeah, so this weekend is quite fun. I obviously did nothing today. It was literally just a full work day. So I was doing admin most of the, the whole day, actually. So now I'm leaving the house for the first time. I have a five o'clock appointment with Dr. Zenda to just check my uterus. And then on, on Saturday morning, tomorrow, we're going to go play paddle. I'm going to go play paddle with my mama and co, some friends that I've made from mama and co. So we're going to go play paddle and my cousin is joining us this time around. Um, and then in the afternoon, I'm supposed to go to Bobby Blanco's brunch at 3 p.m. I don't know if we're actually going to go. Komoto is keen to go, so we might do that. Mom and dad, like, fun time out. It is a party kind of thing, so that might be fun to do. And then in the evening, really nothing. Just see my baby. So I am jam-packed. And then on Sunday, make it to church and church and what and then my cousin Gamo and I are taking our kids out our kids are around similar ages we both have two kids two small kids um so we're gonna take them out to something museum some museum that she found in Rosebank we're gonna go take the kids there so that's the plans for this weekend um it's quite jam-packed it's quite fun so I figured let me get in a cute vlog and see maybe it'll come out to something really nice and exciting and you guys will enjoy it even though I'm really enjoying the sitting down even you should tell because I'm babbling right now instead of just saying welcome to my youtube channel enjoy this vlog don't forget to actually don't forget to like comment share and subscribe please subscribe keep subscribing guys engage 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 I'm so grateful every single time I post I do get some new subscribers which is just a sign that I need to just be consistent and also before I run thank you so much for the most amazing comments on my previous video the one about leaving work 
I am so grateful for you guys um, being super supportive and so kind and just super encouraging. So thank you. You guys really are my online village and I appreciate it. And enjoy this vlog. Subscribe. Protecting my peace for so long A little too good, now I'm so low Watching reruns of the same shows Almost every party I'm a no-show Even with green lights I don't go Never been sure, no I don't know How does everybody has to let go Of the ego Don't go out nearly as much as I should Barely know the way around my neighborhood I'm ruminating, I feel no good Not living life like I know It is Monday morning. I am on my way to the gym. My day has started what feels like ridiculously late, but at least I've gotten all my admin out. I am on my way to the gym. It is, I don't know, is this angled correctly? It is like 2.11 and so I figured let me just go to the gym. Let me get it done with. Let me do my first session and then I'll go in the evening with Hubster. It's Monday morning. I did not vlog a lot because to be quite honest, I forgot, like I was in the moment, I, I forgot to vlog. So I took real content, but not vlogging content. I'm going to the gym now with Gabo because I figured she's going to sleep in an hour. Let me just go with her, burn some energy off. She'll go to the kids area at the gym. Um, yesterday I was supposed to take the kids out with my cousin. We're supposed to go to museum something in Rosebank and no, we did not go. I was so hung over it. I was so hung over and I regret the way I drank. And quite honestly, I was telling Komozo, like I had like a come to, I don't want to say a come to Jesus moment, but I had like a, I had a little bit of a moment where I was like, this is not it like mm -mm. I not that I didn't have fun I did have fun it was a lot like what like how we used to party back in my youth I mean I'm still youth I'm young but yeah it was a lot it was a lot like that so I, the stand is not in still so my angle keeps shifting it's so annoying um, it's not tight enough So yeah, so we partied Quite hard. I only got home at Half past 6 a.m. in the morning Yep, we got home at half past 6 a.m. in the morning Which is kind of crazy <laughs> It's kind of crazy. We were out went to the party this angling you guys are gonna hate me we went to the party at um, 6 p.m. and then literally only got home at half past six which is ridiculous but we did have fun I won't lie but that amount of drinking is actually not necessary <laughs> but I think it's just we also haven't done it in like years so it was it was a shock to the system so yesterday I was hung over the whole day and that's just not something I want to do. I don't want that life. Hold on, let me get in. Mommy? Yes, mama. Who's gym Gabo's going? It's mommy's gym. Gabo's going to mommy's gym. I don't want to say it on here, but I guess people will probably see it. <sighs> okay. Yeah, so as much as fun it was had, I was hung over the whole of yesterday, which is not ideal. Being hung over meant I could not do anything. Um, literally had to just sleep and try and recover the whole day. So I did not get to take my kids out like I 
planned because I just needed to sleep and rehydrate. I did nothing. I could not film. I could like nothing. I could not do anything because I was just hanging and trying to recover and come to life again. So that's annoying. So that's why I feel like mm -mm, this is not the kind of lifestyle I want. Like I feel like I wasted a day. And then again, I was still tired in the evening. So I think I woke up super late this morning. Like I didn't get to do my journaling. I didn't, I, mm -mm, I was in there. Guys, when I tell you something about spiritual warfare, but anyway, I don't want to get into that. I could literally feel my... I was having fun. There were, but there was lots of moments where I was like, you shouldn't be here. This is... Mm -mm. And then I had to even tell Komoto, like, the guilt. It's not just the mom guilt, but it's spiritual guilt. I don't know. So I don't have a problem with drinking. I don't have a problem with drinking. And I feel like if you want to drink, like, Christian or not okay like i'm a christian that drinks it's just how you drink the settings that you drink in your behavior when you're drinking that's what i have a, a battle a problem with and that's what was happening in my head and my heart that battle fell off anyway i'm at the gym so because i didn't vlog a lot over the weekend um and i didn't vlog anything yesterday i figured let me vlog my monday with you guys as well added to this vlog i'm going to the gym taking cover with and then what else am i doing today and i'm just shooting so my vlog will probably end here i think yeah it will end after the gym okay <laughs> it'll end after the gym and then i'll pick up with the rest of the week i don't know we'll see let's go to the gym are you ready hello everybody Tell myself all the same lies I'm in need therapy 